According to AFMC, there were 18,900 applicants for med school in Canada. There's an 81% of that Canadian applicants that were rejected. For a lot of them, their dream of becoming doctors stopped there but doesn't have to. Trinity School of Medicine can provide that opportunity for them to really still see their dream come true. I had already applied twice to medical school back home in Canada. I applied once uh, to the US and it was just so, so competitive um, with such amazing applicants and such limited amount of spots. It didn't make sense for me to wait anymore and eventually it just came down to do I want to be a doctor in Canada or do I want to be a doctor? I went to my interview at Trinity and had a really great interview. I felt very understood and accepted and I decided that that was going to be the best choice for me and I think it was the best choice. Trinity is an excellent choice for students. Number one reason is we're a small school. We're a very tight community. Most Caribbean schools will bring in three, four, five hundred students per semester. And the students get lost in those scenarios. I've seen it both in the data and anecdotally. At Trinity, we bring in students anywhere from 25 to 75 students. So we have a tight community with our students and we can really cater our teaching to each student individually. I felt like the student network, and in particularly the staff network, on the island was very key for me. And I felt like I could always find someone on campus who was able to point me in the right direction, give me textbooks, give me advice, just give me encouragement. So I felt like I felt really just surrounded by people who cared about me finishing and doing well. I would definitely say Trinity supports us Canadians and getting residency, whether it be in the U.S. or Canada. Anytime I've reached out for help, they, they've been very supportive. And the other students at Trinity who have done it before are very supportive. And I don't regret my decision at all coming to Trinity. Trinity is extremely unique, not only in the sense of other Caribbean schools, but even in U.S. schools, in that we get to participate in hospital medical activities in the first semester that we start. While you're in the first two years of medical school, which are the hardest years of your lives, you still don't lose focus on what you're working towards. You get to see yourself in a hospital setting every single week, reminding that you're still working towards becoming a medical professional and actually working with patients. I think it's vital that Trinity students have this introduction to clinical medicine opportunity on the island. I think it helps them get comfortable talking to the patients. It helps them take effective history and physicals. It exposes them to actual practical clinical medicine as opposed to just book work. And I think it makes them more successful in their third and fourth years. I definitely think that Trinity has positioned me well for my residency from the medical knowledge that we got right from the beginning. It was so thorough and we had great scores on all of our standardized tests. Going forward, the medical, the clerkships that I did, I thought the preceptors were amazing. I learned so much. We were really in like a setting of working with a lot of patients, doing a lot of notes, that type of stuff. So I definitely think they've prepared me well for residency. And then going into the match for residency, they definitely gave me quite a bit of support along the way, trying to decide which pathways to go, which places to apply to which places to interview, so I really feel blessed to have them. <laughs> medical education is very important. I think it's the lifeblood of any medical organization. We do see a phenomenal amount of pathology in the area, which provides us, of course, with uh, excellent teaching opportunities for the students as they come through, and so they will get uh, hands-on experience in our EDs up on the floor in the offices of community preceptors to see patients first and foremost and incorporate that into their learning processes, which is key to their success going forward. We're working directly with that doctor. Instead of having so many other students that may see that patient instead, it's just us. The volume of patients that we're seeing, we are seeing up to 40 patients a day in very different settings, from the hospital in rotations or in the clinic coming in for well visits, seeing rare patients that you only read about in textbooks. It's incredible. It's really great that Trini schedules my rotations because I haven't had to worry about them at all. I and mean, I know it's different in other institutions, so I really appreciate that. And we have someone that we work with who's also open to communication, so I can tell her if there's something specific I want in a preceptor or if there's something specific I want in a rotation. And she's been lovely at making sure that I've gotten that and that I have a well-rounded experience. So I think that's great that Trinity schedules those and they take who you are into consideration. We have the Central Georgia Tech didactics now that we have to incorporate those clinical 
hospital skills. So the students have the opportunity to practice the procedures that they're learning at the hospital. So they work side by side with the nursing students, learning how to do specific procedures, what their roles and responsibilities are. And this will learn that direct supportive communication in a high stress environment. So they can be more prepared when starting their residency programs. Having that interpersonal training and that interdisciplinary training is an opportunity that most medical schools do not provide. And I'm almost disappointed that I didn't have that opportunity myself. Through the success of our residency program, our residents tend to have a very high success rate on the exams that are required post-residency. And the Trinity numbers are growing in our residency program. And our test success rate has continued to be very high. That has to tell me that the Trinity students are, are equally, or if not exceeding the preparation level of other uh, students that enter our residency program. When I first started at the island, there we didn't have many Canadians. Our school was 33% Canadian at the time, but we didn't have a lot of representation for Canada in terms of administration. Um, and Trinity took it upon themselves uh, in coordination with the Canadian students to help figure out what we needed to do to be able to also meet the requirements for the Canadian residency match. So we had, an, Canadian students had an opportunity to match there as well. They've made a lot of progress and they're very aware and open. I have never seen a student focus like I see at Trinity. And I have been in Caribbean medical education for 16 years. I have worked for other Caribbean medical schools and it, it, when a student is accepted, they're sort of, here's the website, here's the financial aid information. The students are on their own from the get-go. And we just don't do that. We wanna make sure that they transition well, both academically and otherwise. And we're with them all the way through as they're moving through the program. We know where they're struggling, we know where their strengths are, and we can really put that together to make sure that they are a very strong, knowledgeable, empathetic physician. Trinity School of Medicine is really one of the best choices you could ever make uh, in choosing the med school for you. And we have a lot of Canadian alumni that have gone back to Canada to practice medicine. It was an amazing feeling, especially just hearing your name over the speaker, Dr. Mackenzie Thompson. That was the most exciting part. It's been a long journey, but uh, it was totally worth it. If it's what you want to do, it wasn't hard at all. I'm from Canada, and I could have gone back home, but actually the American residency programs are pretty darn good, so don't uh, limit yourself. That was, uh, that was a good choice.